Hey, it's December. I am putting up my Christmas tree. And it's not just any Christmas tree. We're personalizing ornaments to make it a Tori Does Everything tree. Run, run, Rudolph! Santa gonna make it down! <laughs> Alright, that was good. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we're gonna start by showing y'all some ornaments that we are going to put on the tree. We had a local person that makes things, handcrafted things, make some of these ornaments for us. Mm -hmm. We're gonna try to make everything Tori Does Everything related. So there's mm -hmm. YouTube logo. One day Tori's gonna win a what? Globe, golden globe golden globe maybe we hope and then the dollar tree had some of these too some clacker boards so those will probably make a good tree topper mm -hmm. and of course you can't have a christmas tree without what tinsel no you can go without tinsel no tinsel's a must without candy canes candy canes Here's the thing we're also going to show you how to do. Have y'all ever heard of something called... Shrinky Dinks. Shrinky Dinks. They are dinks that shrink. Mm -hmm. Here is the package. Okay, that's what they look like when you buy them. Mm -hmm. And you can make your own ornaments, right? So here, yep. let's show them on camera one that we made. This isn't going to go up on it because it's a little bit too small. So We over shrinked our dink. Yeah, mm -hmm. so we made a role model, but it ended up being too small, but we'll show y'all how to make them a little bit mm -hmm. bigger. So we'll do that in just a little bit. So mm -hmm. first, let's go shrink some. Thanks. Thanks. This is the paper that you use for making shrinky dinks. It, it works in. better if you do it like this than when you do it like this. That's not It true. doesn't matter. Okay, there is a rough side and a smooth side. You want to draw on the rough side, on the mm -hmm. side that's a little bit rougher. So you draw what you want first. And then you trace around it. Now, keep in mind, it's going to get small, so you want to do it big enough to be an ornament. So yeah. we're going to make two ornaments per sheet. Mm -hmm. So we drew on our paper first, like this, and then you lay your shrinky dink on top and trace it, and then you color it in. Mm -hmm. And then here's a very important step you don't want to forget. You got to go like this <laughs> You're gonna... when you're tracing them. That's a step. You're going to cut it out, but you're also not going to forget to punch a hole in the top of your ornament like this. Mm -hmm. The hole will shrink too, but it'll end up being the perfect size for mm -hmm. hanging. Yeah. All right, so you'll put your holes in, and then you'll trim these out, and then you're going to put them in the oven, and we'll show you how to do that. Okay, we are ready to shrink our shrinky dink. We have this here. You can see about, about the size of my hand, about how big that this is right here. And we are gonna put it in the oven. It has been preheating at 325. So let's open the oven up. You can see here, just like this. And we're gonna slide it in. And we're gonna close the door. And we'll let you watch. Um, it usually takes about three minutes for this to start shrinking, and I do one at a time. Okay, it's normal for them to curl like that and kind of roll around on themselves. But eventually, just leave it alone. Don't open the oven and start messing with it. What you want to do is just leave it alone. It will flatten itself out, usually. Um, every once in a while, one will mess up. But most of the time, they're going to do just fine if you leave them alone. Wait for it to flatten. And once it's flat, count to 30 seconds before you open the oven. I'd say that is flat enough, so we're going to wait 30 seconds. Okay, now it's been long enough. Let's open it up your oven mitt so that you don't get burned. And you're going to pull that out and you can see they do get pretty small. While it's still warm, take you a flat spatula and flatten it out. And then you just let it sit and it'll harden up and then you can stick a string on it and it's ready to hang on the tree. Welcome back and we're putting the ornaments on the tree. This is the tree. Uh, and it already comes with lights, so we didn't need the 
It's we're a pre-lit tree. Mm-hmm. Okay. And Which we're is gonna, the way to go. We're going to scoot it mm-hmm. in here. And we're going to put all our ornaments on it. All we're right. All, but if it's too full, we won't. But we're going to try to put as many as we can. All right. We're going to try to make this YouTube related to Tori's channel. Mm-hmm. So we'll show you some things we found. We found a camera ornament. Mm-hmm. We're going to stick that on. And we're not going to take too much time to do it. We're just going to do it pretty quick. Yep. Uh, we got the like button. Y'all be sure and hit the like button mm-hmm. and make sure you subscribe too. Be sure and prescribe. <laughs> so we got us a like button. We'll stick that here. We found some popcorn. Get your mm-hmm. popcorn ready. Get your popcorn ready. Why don't y'all come kind of tell us some uh, Christmas movies that y'all like to watch while you eat your popcorn. Well, my favorite of all the time is the Santa Claus. We have already watched um, Home Alone. Mm-hmm. We've watched Die uh, Hard. Die Hard. We've watched. And um, before y'all make a comment, yes, Die Hard is a Christmas movie. Look at this Grinchy one. You're a mean one, Tori Nicole. I'm glad they put the original Grinch on. Yes. Um, Peacock because everybody, everybody on Netflix was like. Oh, let's just put the Jim Carrey one on. But that one's not good. Okay, we got a microphone mm-hmm. for a microphone. Mhm. Some YouTubing. Mhm. Golden Globe. Golden or Globe. Amy. I forget which one it is. Mm, I don't watch the ceremony. We're looking good already. Yeah. I'm getting it done. Santa baby. Camera. We got a YouTube button there. We had these lo- made by a local artists. Mm-hmm. And also, Dad, I was going to tell you, Santa Baby is the weirdest song ever. Like, who wants to flirt with Santa? He's just an old guy. Like. So, I was going to say the Twisted Sister version of I Saw Mommy Kissing Santa Claus. Oh, yeah, that's inappropriate. Don't watch that, kids. We got this role model here. So our shrinky dinks, they turned out really good. Just make sure you make them bigger because if you don't, mm-hmm. they will um, be too little. Hey, Tori, mm-hmm. while we have everybody's attention, the movie The Santa Claus, you didn't like it for a while. Mm-hmm. But now you say that there's one part in that movie that reminds you of you when you was a little kid. Mm-hmm. Would you like to share that with the audience? Yes. And it's like, you never do anything for me, Dad. And also the part... Um, that's actually still me now, is when they're at the Denny's, and, and he's like, I want a chocolate milk, and they're like, we're all out of chocolate milk, what else do you want? And he's like, plain milk's fine. <laughs> <laughs> all chocolate milk, please. We're out. Plain milk's fine. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Yep. Oh, yeah, I always think about that part where he's like, Come on, let's get the sleigh and fly all over the world and deliver presents. He goes, no, we're not doing that. Yeah. You, you never, never do what I, I want to do. do. Mm-hmm. I feel like that's every five-year-old in existence. Guys, we're about done. It I didn't think, take long to decorate this tree. I think Tori picked out a good tree, and mm-hmm. I think Mom did a great job decorating it. Yeah. And I think what, all that's missing is a David Lee Roth tree topper. Mm-hmm. Oh, how awesome would that be? He could do the splits. <laughs> On top of his drum set, yeah. yeah. If only we knew of anyone that had that tree top. <laughs> hmm, James, I wonder where I can find something like that. All right, hey guys, this looks really good. There it is. Look how good it looks, everyone. Yes, it's very cute. It turned out good. Dad, turn the lights back on so everybody can see a little better. There we go. You can see that these all turned out really good. So it doesn't matter if you make them yourself or if you go to the Dollar Tree or you go to Hobby Lobby or you have a local artisan make you things or whatever. Hobby Lobby. Whatever you do is great. Isn't that right, Alistair? That is 100% correct. All right. I like Christmas trees and I like to kiss Tori's hand. Well, we want to tell you all to have a Merry Christmas. So on the count of three, Tori, one, two, three. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Everybody. Alistair wanted to dress up too. 
Alistair Pose. <laughs> His shirt's falling off. Oh no. This is it. This is inappropriate, Alistair. Put your pose back on. All I want for Christmas is food. Is food? Yeah! Mm -hmm. Hey, I hope y'all get some good Christmas food this year. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, what do you say? Mm -hmm. Bye! Okay. Be sure and prescribe. Okay. Be sure and prescribe. <laughs> I can't say it.